Hi everyone and welcome to Planet No Code. Today's video is about Langchain and No Code. If you have been watching our previous content, we have already introduced you to Langchain. Um, but here we wanted to give you a quick in-depth overview of what Langchain can do and what are the No Code tools available today that you can use to build your own Langchain powered apps. Just to give you a quick reminder, Langchain is a framework that allows you to build uh, applications which are powered by um, large language models such as OpenAI's GPT-4. Uh, a lot of you have been building your own applications using Bubble and No Code. Langch allows you to use lang large language models like OpenAI's GPT-4 and allow you to perform certain tasks that are not possible with GPT-4 on their own. For example, if you want to build a chatbot that does text-to-speech or text-to-image or any sort of chatbots, such as you do chat with a PDF or any other documents, a chatbot that would have access to a database, then Langchain is your buddy. Now, the, the, the good news with that is that this is open source and freely available for everyone to use. However, it's written in Python and JavaScript. So if you don't know Python or JavaScript and you're looking for a no code version that allows you to be able to experiment with Langchain, then this video is for you. So just to give you a quick overview of the no code tools then that are available, right? So the first one is Langflow. Just before I dive into this, these tools, you need to have Visual Studio code installed and a version of Python installed because these tools run on Python, but setting them up and using them or building your own Langchain applications with them is very, very straightforward if you follow the uh, documentation instructions. So I'm just going to go through to Langflow and just show you how this looks like. So here you just need two commands. Uh, once you have Visual Studio Code and Python and Langchain installed, you can install Langflow using these commands and then be able to use it uh, no code it's very simple to use it looks a lot like this and then it allows you to um, build your langchain powered applications without writing a single line of code all you would need is your api keys from your openai's gpt4 or any other large language model that you're using and then you can use the drag and drop module which you're already used to uh, using as no coders uh, to be able to build your LLM powered apps. And then you can run these to check like how your bot will work and look like. The next one we've got on our list is Flowwise. Flowwise is also very similar um, drag and drop interface that allows you to build Langchain powered apps. Uh, it's very similar to Langchain, but it's a lot better in terms of the, the UI and the interface and how it works. I'm not really sure how production ready it is at the moment, but at least it allows you to start playing around and start building with it. I'm pretty sure it will be production ready very soon, um, the way things are going. Another tool that we have, which is very similar to the Flowwise, uh, is Relevance AI. And this again, allows you to do the same. So again, I'm on their website now and you can check it out in terms of how it looks like and how it works. You can follow the documentation as to how you can set it up and run it. And here it shows you an example of how uh, you can use relevance and OpenAI's GPT-4 together, but you can do a lot of other things like PDF to text and so on and so forth. Again, this is much more production ready than Flowwise, just like Langchain, uh, sorry, Langflow. The final tool that we have that we wanted to showcase today is SuperAgent. Now, SuperAgent is very interesting because it allows you to build, deploy, and manage your LLM-powered agents. Now, what is an agent? I can't do a better job of describing an agent than they have done, but in summary, it's a program or a system that is capable of perceiving its environment and making decisions or taking actions on the basis of instructions. So you give instruction to an agent and then they perform a specific task that they are coded to do right so this tool allows you to build your own agents for example if you want to build an agent that takes instructions and performs certain tasks like doing some research then 
you know this is this is your thing and just to let you know we have over 150 bubble tutorials which are available on um, our website and our platform a lot of these tutorials are not available online so i highly recommend that you check out our website and please like and subscribe if you enjoy our content and let me know in the comments which platform you want me to deep dive into and show you some use cases on and we'll, we're going to do that next time thank you very much guys have a good day.